Hey guys! Welcome to another episode of The Legend of Zelda The Winds Waker. In the last episode, we just collected some pieces of heart. We went around just uh, doing some maps. This was the third episode of actual just side quests. And now we're on to the story. And we went to this island and it was all doomed and stuff. And we also got another piece of heart. And now we got about eight, I think. Yeah, eight. Um, we need to get ten, but I'm not going to bother because it's going to take too long. Um, but yeah, we visited this island and Jubby Jubby's gone and we have to go see him now. So, with that being said, Ganon's taking control of this planet and we have to make sure he doesn't. Let's go. So, where are we? We have to go to Windfall. So, how's everyone today? My day's pretty good. It's just recording this video. I'm, I've recorded episode 13? And now this is episode 14, I think. I might record one more episode and then that's it. Um, I think I think we're going to enter the Tower of Gods today, if I have enough time. I'm just so curious. Why is there always storms when Ganon's around? Like, for a second thought, it just was raining constantly, I think. And now it's just raining now. What's the point of that? I don't get that. I totally forgot we have Forsaken Fortress again. But we can just storm the place and destroy it. Fun fact, did you know when Ganon takes over the world, just like right now, like he is now, it'll be eternal darkness, like legitimately, it'll be night time the entire time. Like w when you um, saw it, he has the power to like make it night time in just one certain area, depending on what Ganon it is. This one can somehow control the weather and the moon cycle, which is insane. That will make him more powerful than... Okay, somehow I teleported to that island. Like, to the other side of it. I'm like, what? It's just as the postman told us. Oh, yeah, yeah, Mr. Postman! <laughs> told us the pirate ship has stopped here to avoid... To avoid... Drawing the attention to the folk, townsfolk. Hey, is that lady there? The one that will give me the third bottle. Oh, so now you're gonna give me the piece of heart. Oh, is this tingle? Oh, the okay. Oh my god, why is this so weird? Link, just... What? I might as well just jump it. Oh, okay, apparently jumping it doesn't work. Why Why was I having so much trouble with that? Great, thanks Link, you made me waste so much time. What happens if we just open the door? Thank you! Why did that take so much precious time? Now it's 47 minutes. Thanks, Link. I, I hate Tetris so much. Just took a picture of that on my phone. Like, no one's going to remember Chumberlin. Chumberlin? What does that even mean? Alright, let's... Now we head on to this ship. Huh. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why they would just tie them up and not worry about them. But they do have obsessive prices. Like, I mean, you had this coming. And now we can go over here and steal their money. For all the people they rob. Well, technically I'm robbing them. Oh my god, it's not even a... So it has to be a capital. Oh, I didn't put another M in it. Oh my. We can go in Tetra's bedroom. You know, take this, Tetra. I'm on your bed, Tetra. I'm on your bed. Take this, Tetra. 
Look at this nerd worshipping the hero. What a nerd. And by the way, this, um, hey, all to those Earth, the people that think that Earth's flat, hey, take that. The Hyrule is not flat. It's a spear. Earth is a spear. Just get over it, all right? Yo, it's my Kaji G. How's it going? Oh, and my old swaggy. Link. And he's going to show me do this, you swing and jump, do this. Look, I've done this a million times. Why would you want to listen to that dialogue? It's basically just teaching you how to swing and stuff. This guy did a two second flat. He sees human expectations. Mm. Mm. Ugh. That's weird that opened the gate in the same place as before. So go step on it. Shut. What if it just moon jumped? That's the grace and doing all this stuff. What? Oh. Okay, we're gonna be here for a while, so I'll just cut until I reach it. I did that in one try. Imagine you just locked some on me. I mean, if you just locked me in here with the bombs, and then I'll just explode the back of the ship, and I can get out. I suppose I should be shown, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look of your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? You don't have to give things more of thought, do you? You have to just rush in, never thinking how badly things could go for you. Just like now, the only reason you got what you did was because we uh, we left a simple-minded little rat like Nico behind to look after things. <laughs> I'm not gonna listen to her. Tetra's a babbling. Everything about her, I just hate. I just hate Tetra. I hate. I hate. I hate her. Like when she's a princess. Oh my god. Like I begin becoming a super intense Minecraft player. But like when she's a, a pirate, man, imagine. I don't care if she has a boring personality. It's a lot better than what she had previously. I might go to, to all the, um, well, if this one can't give me what I need, then, well, that's gonna suck. Oh yeah, well, yeah, we can just bomb that up. Oh, that's not how you use bombs. Bye-bye. I totally forgot how to use them. Yes, our first great fairy, technically. Not great fairy, fountain. Are you gonna give us a bigger wallet or bombs? Probably bombs. We got big bombs. <laughs> we got big bombs. Yes, thank you, Great Fairy. If this is like 99 bombs, then oh, that's good. I think if it's blue, it's um a bomb. But if it's a different color, maybe like yeah, I think I think it was the same color. So this is bombs again. Yep, 99 bombs, sweet.
Might as well get my fairy bottle out. Oh, sad grandma, big sad. Boom, take my fairy. Oh, hang on, what? Funny how uh, fairies can cure depression. Just, just like that. <gasps> Link! Oh, Link! Oh, Link, my dear sweet Link. You are safe. That's wonderful. Just wonderful. Do you, did you just do this? Did you heal me? Oh, you're such a sweet child. Oh, that's right. You and your sister, Arrow. I tried so hard to be strong, and I've been sitting here moaning and worrying. I'm your grandmother. I'm the one who should be taking care of you. I'm so sorry, Link. I haven't even considered what you must be going through. I'm a terrible grandma. You're moaning and groaning. You're fine what you're doing. It's fine. You don't have to worry. My, my granny worries about me and... And I, I feel the same way, but it's really sad. But like, the thing is, when you worry about me, it just leads to more distress. And, I, and hearing that just worries me. And now she's happy. No more of that sad music. I don't like that sad music. There was this pig. Like this big ass pig. Okay. There is this big pig that we can find and it can dig up like a piece of heart. But I don't think we can do that yet. Can I never land on the boat properly? Yes, thank you, Link. Not Link. King of Red Lions. Let's go. That was easy. Don't even know why they bother putting a whirlpool here. Jabu Jabu. Oh my god, it's Ganon. Oh no, it's just a big fish. We met indeed, Javu. I am blessed to see that you are safe. Yes, it seems that like, seems Ganon has returned. There can be no long, uh, any other explanation. Unfortunately, that is not so. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. I do. It is the only way. Oh my god, candy, let's go! Oh man, radical awesome! You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spirit Jaboon was kind enough to give you the, this gem. A treasure of one of the goddesses. So the foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of the, the curse brought on us by Ganon. He must intend to cast this land in pure darkness for all of time. I believe I have. How does this dude... Oh, okay, I guess I understand why. Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that Jabu's gave us. So morning has come soon. Should come soon. It is well that we gathered all the pearls. Uh, 
Uh, that should be easy, and that's where I end off the episode. I only used 10 bombs for that. Wow. I thought I used more than that. I know. Did that dude just go through the island? Oh, wait, so I've got the blue one instead. <laughs> Wandering traveler who seeks the guidepost of the goddesses. Place your pearl you hold here. I might actually get someone to voice act this. I don't know. I just had the sudden urge to do that. Two pearls remain. Let's go. This is the green one. Wandering traveler who seeks the guidepost of the goddesses, place your pearl you hold here. Yay, we'll put in one pearl remains. Let's go. And this one wandering traveler who seeks the guidepost of the goddesses place your pearl you hold here Uh, like run! It didn't explode. What? Pew. No, Link! This is the second time he's been flung. Damn, they look magnificent. She looks magnificent as well. She looks magnificent. <gasps> the Twi Force. OMG, that is a big tower. What if Link gets impaled? Oh. That ruined whatever tension it ever had. Oh. Oh, you were right, Linky. <laughs> Linky. I'm not using that name again. Whoa. That's massive. That's... You, you do minded people in the comments. Oh my god. This tower. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I need to end the episode off here. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. It was a real pleasure doing this, honestly. I loved, I love this game. And like, we're going to be doing the Tower of the Gods, so... Oh, I can't wait. So, with, without further ado, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.